Sean Sewell with ingearment.com, one of our favorite places in the mountains of Colorado. Right now we are testing out the Bearskin Tactical Hoodie from True Swap. This is a fleece jacket that's full of pockets and updates from the previous version. I know a lot of people on the internet have been requesting these features, so we're really excited to share with you first these updates. So let's get into it. First and foremost, let's talk about sizing. I am six foot one, 210 pounds, 45 inch chest, 33 inch waist, 36, 37 on the arms. This is a men's extra large. It is a good fit, especially in my chest and upper back. That's something I have a little bit of a trouble with, with a lot of jackets they are meant for really trim people. And I'm more of an athletic build. So it's nice to have that accommodation. The gut has a little more room, um, which is totally fine. You can adjust the hem right there to seal that up. And then, then you're good. You're keeping that warmth in. It is a 320 weight fleece. That's a substantial fleece. So that's gonna give you a lot of warmth. It's very, very comfortable. Um, not only myself, but Dan Jimenez and Ryan Humphreys, fellow and Gimmert riders, also vets, um, were actually very curious about this before I even was even aware that as a company. They had seen this in their Instagram or Facebook feed and they were really curious about it because you can put the morale patches on. It has that tactical background and look to it. And then both being vets and very active were curious about it. Serendipitously, stars aligned and they sent us over three. So we'll have three different reviews for you on this new version. One of the big updates on this is the upgraded fleece to 320, which is, I, uh, I jokingly called it a tactical snuggie because it's really, really comfortable. And how I used it was uh, here camping in the fall here in Colorado. Uh, last night I got down to about 28 degrees Fahrenheit and I had just, just this then on over a 150 weight wool shirt and I was good to go. In fact, I slept in it in our rooftop tent with just one 20 degree quilt and I was good to go. Usually I'd have a 20 degree quilt with an additional quilt just to keep me warm, but nope, this tactical snuggie, as I called it, uh, was very, very cozy. Another big update, and this one I think is really important, is the hood is now adjustable. I gone through previous reviews and people loved the jacket, but didn't like the hood. So they listened and now you can adjust the hood, which is nice. It's still a very sizable hood, fits over my hat, no problem. It's got this additional flaps right there. Not too sure if you're a fan of it or not. I've never actually seen that in other gear before. Nine pockets nine nine pockets so we got two hand pockets right here zippered of course one napoleon pocket right there next to the microphone two arm pockets sizable at that and you'll notice morale patch areas right there so we're going to actually have some made for our vet based gym existence athletics as well on the inside oh first i should note double zippers one two so that make a lot of people happy right there and European style zipper is on the other side. Boop. On the inside. Drop pockets. One drop pocket. Two drop pocket. Three drop pocket? Yeah, there's a third drop pocket behind the Napoleon pocket. So, plenty of ways to keep gear organized. Good neck coverage, and like I mentioned, double zipper. The, my observation on sizing is pretty spot on. The only thing I'm not a fan of is this extra girth in the forearms. However, as my colleague Ryan Humphreys pointed out, I'd rather have extra girth here than have it be that super trim Alpine fit that we often come across with uh, a lot of mountain based brands that seem to be geared towards really skinny people, which is fantastic. I know a lot of climbers are very svelte, uh, runners and such. Um, us, with our fitness background and liking to pick things up that are heavy and put them back down, have a little bit more sizable girth in our forearm, which allows us to do our activities with more ease. There's also many studies that show that grip strength correlates to quality of life and length of life. Something to look into. Long story longer, better to err on baggier than trimmer. So my, my observation complaint is about nil. You do also have hook and loop adjustment right there to accommodate that. So here it is, it's a 320 weight fleece jacket that's got that tactical look with like nine pockets, very comfortable. Uh, it's tactical, right? They have that in a word. Um, I, I call it the tactical snuggie because it's so flipping comfortable. And uh, I enjoy it for, for what I've been using it for, base camp, a uh, little bit of hike, and I wouldn't want to go ski touring and so it would get warm really, really fast, which is I think most of the demographics are shooting for. Warmth, comfort, at aesthetic 
position. So if you're looking to keep warm, fuzzy, and you like that aesthetic of the tactical look, this might be on your radar. If so, it's a very fair price. I think MSRP before discounts is like $220, $240, but it's on sale as of this review, and I'll put a link to that below for $99. For $99, it's, it's a good deal. <laughs> it's a good deal. Hopefully seeing it on a person is helpful to get you an idea on the sizing and the aesthetic and all the functions of the new updated version, updated material, updated hood. Good job with that. I'm Sean Sewell, owner and director of Stokeport and Until next time, take care.